Hey! 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 So they are excited. We're going to make some ranch crackers today. They're really excited. Because <laughs> it's one of your favorite snacks, isn't it? Crackers. You love them, right? We love crackers here. And Mommy's favorite flavor is ranch. And right now what we're doing is we're melting two cups of mozzarella cheese. Um, because that is uh, what we need to make this. Yep, yeah. and we're gonna put um, we're now gonna be heat preheating the oven to 350. Bye, <laughs> bye, no, not bye. <laughs> um, and so we can cook these up, okay? Um, so once the mozzarella cheese is melted, because we're just melting it in the microwave, there it's two cups of shredded mozzarella cheese. We're gonna add the flour, we got some coconut flour here. There is three eighths coconut flour here, and then we have some. Uh, well, we made some ranch spice here, okay. Um, and I'll put all the ingredients of what's in the ranch spice, all that good stuff, um, in the post later on tonight. Okay, it is melted. Let's see this. Oh, it's melted. Okay, so this is what it looks like melted. Okay, and what we're gonna do is, Evelyn, you're gonna add the flour. Can you add the flour? Can you just dump that all into the bowl? Ooh. Ooh. Good job. And then you're going to add the ranch spice. You think you can add the ranch spice? We'll bring it, bring it down to your level. There you go. No, no, no. Hold the ranch. Yeah. Boom. Oh, no, you got some on your hands. Ah! <laughs> okay. And then we're going to mix it, okay? We're going to mix this up. What's, this is going to form as a dough, okay? Once we form the dough, uh, we're going to play around with it. We're going to play around with it. Bless you. <laughs> she probably breathed in the ranch um, uh, little spices we have because I did. And oh my goodness, did I ever, did it was, it was crazy. Like I was like, I was like, wasn't I? <laughs> <laughs> So now we're gonna grab this. What we're gonna do is, oh, it's it's still hot. It's still hot. Mommy's hands. Woo! Um, and we're just gonna pat. Yeah, do it. You're gonna do that when we get on the on the on the table, okay? We're, what we're doing is we're scooping up the. Uh, Mommy does not know how to talk. The flour, <laughs> the flour, and the ranch. Okay, right now. Hey, Scarlett, how's it going? Hey. And we're working it into the dough. Hey, I can see you. Don't worry, they can see you. They can see your beautiful face. Don't you worry. Look. Yeah. Hey. Well, lean forward and they can see your beautiful face. Hey. <laughs> As you can tell, my girls are not camera shy. <laughs> I'm doing this slowly, sorry, because it's a lot harder than I thought it was going to be. <laughs> you would think, right out of the microwave, you'd be like, oh yeah, it's hot. She shouldn't be touching that. And there we go. Okay, I think I got all the powders up. Okay. So now, so I'm try to move this out of the way. I'm take some parchment paper, okay? And this is where Daddy might need to give you a boost. If you ask with, with your manners. What do you say, Daddy? Daddy. Yeah, it's just Daddy. Say, Daddy, please help me. Okay, you see what Mommy's doing? Mm -hmm. We're pushing it down with our fingers. You think you can do that too? Yeah. Yeah. You want to do that? Yeah. Okay, go ahead. Start touching. Oh, ho. It is hot. Oh, honey, it's not that hot. Oh, oh you need a hug. Daddy can give you a hug. It's really not that hot. It's only warm now. I was burning my fingers before. <laughs> and what we're doing is we're flattening this out. Okay, we're going to flatten this dough out. You want to feel it? Feel it. You think it's hot? 
Can you just wipe them? Oh no, it, you're just dirty. <laughs> so we're gonna flatten this out. And you want like really thin, really thin. And you can use a roller. I find using my hands is easier because it keeps the cheese nice and warm and easier to work with. So up to you how you want to roll out. I find that hands is a lot easier to do. And the girls can get involved with it with their fingers. You want to touch it again? Go ahead and try again. You push that down. You want to push Careful. down? Push, push. Do you need daddy to lift you up onto the counter? I'm going to bring it closer, but she still can't reach it. Yeah. Yeah, keep hitting it. Keep hitting it. Now, this is the longest part it's going to take, is actually. It's rolling this out, but we're going to have some fun for a little bit here. And maybe mommy will just get the roller pin. You, you know, you got to pat it. Can you pat it? Like this. There you go. Like that. There you go. Nice. There you go. There you go. There you go. There you go. Okay, I'm gonna pat it. Yeah, just like that. Arr, push down as hard as you can. Push, 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 push. <laughs> so this is like, you know, how you can get your, your kids kind of involved here is getting them, they can add ingredients, they can push down, they can do all those little things. Right? Yeah. yeah. All right, should we get the roller? No, daddy. No. Just for the purpose of this video, so it goes a little bit faster. Go ahead and wash your hands, honey. I don't want you guys sticking on a 20 minute long video where we're just like bashing this for more than half of it. <laughs> oh, she's like, I can't get down. My hands are too dirty. <laughs> Hello, Kayla. How's it going? And we're just going to finish rolling this out. So this recipe actually makes about mm, anywhere between, depending on the size of the crackers that you make them, um, 25 to about 38 crackers. I've made them some from this amount of dough and it's given me close to 50. So it all depends on kind of how thin you get them, how big are the crackers, that sort of thing. We like to do it like pretty thin. We do. Let me see. Okay. Now, at this stage, there's two different ways that you can do this at this stage. You can stick this in the oven right now and may it let, allow it to get nice and crispy and then cut them. Or you can cut them beforehand and um, put them on the tray. Um, so what we're going to do actually is we are going to, um, we're going to cut them now, just so you get that sort of like experience of it. Kind of see how big we get them, that sort of thing. And then we're going to stick them in the oven. I did, I No, you're not going to do it again now that you got cleaned up, okay? We're not waste, wasting cloths and whatnot, okay? So I find the easiest way is with... Um, pizza cutter. So I'm gonna cut it like this into a strip. Okay. This strip is not thin enough. There we go. There we go. We got the muscle coming in. Okay, <clears throat> and then we're going to cut it These little like triangles. You need a big one. 
No, it's as big as mommy's gonna make them, and then we're gonna show them how big they are, okay? Okay. So we cut them in like little triangles, just like this. Okay, I'll put it against my finger. It's like, I don't know, it's no, not that big, okay? Not that big. It's top of my finger, okay? Um, and then what you're gonna do now is uh, we'll take the tray that you have it on, okay? I'm just gonna kind of like show you, so we're not taking too much time up on this video. But you're gonna place them all on the tray. I got different sizes here. It's all good. We we want go eat. It. Okay, and then once they're all on the tray, you're gonna take some pink Himalayan salt because that's how you get the saltiness of it. You're gonna yeah, put some in. You will, okay? Um, and then I saved some of the ranch mixture that we made and you're gonna sprinkle them all on top as well okay and once you're done that you're gonna stick it in the oven for eight to ten minutes depending on how crispy they get how fast they get how your oven is yeah at 350 and then you got yourself some ranch crackers okay so